if uh, Nigerian Navy is making the most of its victories against pirates, these four were lucky. In the past two weeks, around 18 have been killed as Nigeria steps up its anti-piracy effort. Other countries in the region are trying to do the same. We notice that the member states have paid further attention to the issue of piracy, and this has caused pirates to act with greater caution than they did in the past. Still, there were more than 30 attacks in the first six months of this year, according to the International Maritime Bureau. Oil tankers are the favorite target, and about one million tons of crude oil passes through the Gulf of Guinea every year. Because of their inability to control their territorial waters, some states are threatened by political instability. Tube estimates piracy is costing $2 billion a year. Some shipping firms are avoiding the region. Those that are coming in are paying more for insurance and security, and they're taking long routes. If we do not combat piracy of our coast now, in view of our agricultural, energy, and economic potentials, the states risk having fewer resources because insecurity will affect the country's budgets as well as their purchasing power. So far, Nigeria has shown it has the capacity to fight pirates, but the entire region needs to join the battle. The United Nations is urging collective action. Desiree Cano, CCTV, Dakar, Senegal.